So hello and welcome everybody We're from wherever you're tuning in, if it's morning, if it's afternoon, if it's nighttime. So I'm uh, super, super happy now for this specific training because we will go very, very deep into the Jifu back office. We will also go on the travel platform. I want to show you a few uh, little tips and tricks, okay, how you find uh, good, uh, good opportunities for travel. And I also would like to show you um, a few things regarding the free trial because the free trial is something that most people, I think, still underestimate, okay? But before we get into it, uh, pretty quick, uh, please make sure that you use the translation button down below, okay? If you're looking for a translation, if you don't speak English perfectly, check it out. We have four languages today. A big shout out to our translators. We have Marisa Santos doing Italian. We have Leonor Faria doing Portuguese. We have Anna Herbst doing German. And we have uh, Farah Afuni, I hope I pronounced that prob <laughs> probably uh, for Arabic. Okay, so big shout out for our translators. Okay, guys, let's start right into it. And I would love to start with the free trial before we even jump into the back office. Because that is a question that comes very, very often. What is the beauty of the free trial? So we, we spoke in the former video where I talked about the compensation plan, um, that you have a certain number of free trials you can send out. But what does actually happen when you use the free trial? Let me show you. So you see, that's what you see on your left side. This is the distributor. Okay, let me zoom in a little bit. So basically... You see when you go on the platform a 27% off, okay? So this is what you see as a distributor. If you send the free trial to someone, they see exactly the same hotel for exactly the same nights, but they only see a discount of 14%, which is roughly half of your discount, right? So, and then they have the option, this one you see below here, um, that you have... Uh, the possibility to save an extra $541 if you join Jifu, okay? So, what does that mean actually for you? For you, that means that if you send out a free trial, okay, the person who goes on the platform saves $541, but you also get $541, you as the person who referred as a bonus, get it? It's pretty insane, okay? So the free trial only sees 50% of the savings. The other 50% actually is what you get, okay? So then here's a question uh, from Annie. Why is the public price not the same? Because when I recorded the screenshots, I did it at different times. And prices change every few minutes, sometimes by the minute, okay? So if you go in and you check something, then... Uh, you wait like five minutes, you check it again, prices will change because everything works in algorithms, okay? It's not that there is a person sitting, basically typing in the prices, everything adapts. A new room is sold, perfect. We adapt the price and so on. That is the reason why you don't always uh, get exactly the same price if you do a comparison and there's like 10 minutes in between, for example, okay? So this is basically how the free trial works. How do you get the money then? So you get travel points first, which you can load in your travel portal, and they will be shown at the top. Then you can do two things with those travel points. You can switch them to pay them out into US dollars onto your e-wallet directly in Jifu, or you can use them for your own travel. These are the two choices. So pretty, pretty good deal, um, and uh, you can decide whatever you want to do with it, okay? So this is basically how the free trial works. Now, um, we're going to go or we're going to jump uh, before we go into the back office uh, and I'm going to show you a few comparisons because also we had the questions lately that people said, oh, I don't find the best price all the time and what's the best way to look for it. So here's the thing, what you need to understand. Let me, let me point it this way. So if you are looking for a specific hotel, at a specific time and a specific room you want to have, possibly you will not find that on Jifu. 
possibly you will also not find that on Booking or Expedia. Because if you have very, very specific terms, then you best talk to hotel because then you want your points. It's like me. When I fly, I always fly Emirates because I have a great reward system. I'm a gold member at Emirates. I get uh, like very cheap upgrades. So I stick with it. That's what they basically do. So I wouldn't use any platform basically and look for my specific flight there. Does it make sense? So then... um, Thank you, Leonor. She just posted. I don't know how Leonor does that. She's translating and answering and texting at the same time. It's the second time. So 10,000 travel points is $100. Exactly. So, okay. So let's look into uh, a few comparisons. So I have a comparison here for you guys. Um, This is a screenshot which I did from uh, booking. So because I was looking for a friend of mine who wanted to come to Dubai, okay? So it's the second one here. Let me also position that a little bit different. So you see here, so we're talking about the hired residency uh, residence Dubai hotel. Okay. So exactly the same hotel and you already see the price difference, but let me go a little bit deeper into it so you can actually see. So you see the G4 price is actually um, 924 and this includes tax. And now look below, there you see the original price used to be, this is already an offer, by the way, from booking. The original price used to be, you see here, there's a big line through it, 2,491 plus 350 tax, okay? And this is almost uh, $3,000. But they already have a discount, so the price on booking is 1,495, but still you have to pay the 353 taxes and charges. So it's still um, almost $2,000. And you see Jifu beats that price by a big, big margin, okay? So what you need to understand when you're looking, when you're searching, if you would go directly on booking, okay? You go directly on booking or on Expedia and you say, I'm looking for this specific hotel or whatever in Dubai or in Paris or in wherever. So what you would see by default is they show their offers first. And I don't know if any one of you ever booked through Expedia or booking uh, or wanted to book and it was expensive and you decided, you know what, I'm going to call the hotel. Maybe they give me a better price. Did the hotel give you a better price? No, it was more expensive even, right? So they said, no, sorry, we cannot compete with booking. And you're like, but how come? How can they as a third party provider be cheaper than you as a hotel actually? And there's a big, big story behind it. But basically what they do, if they have offers shown at the top, what they do is they have, they even sell under price because in their whole calculation, it's okay to lose money on some deals if they gain you as a customer long-term and sell you their genius program and you become a long-term customer and then buy regularly. So that's basically how it works. Get my point? So mostly it's hard when you look on booking first or an Expedia first, and you see the first three, four offers, they're all sponsored, okay? You see ad, VIP access, uh, we're going to include breakfast, parking, so they show you a lot of add-ons to actually sell you the hotel. What they don't tell you is that these are the hotels where they make the most margin, and you find that in the terms and conditions, actually, okay? You can check that. If you go to Expedia, terms and conditions, there's a full paragraph, because they have to declare it, that actually says, the hotels shown at the top are the ones we make the most margin with, okay? So these hotels specifically are sometimes hard to beat, but don't forget about the price guarantee we have, okay? Let's go now um, a little bit in um, into the system directly. So let me show you a few live things I just did right now, okay? Just before the call, I jumped in here and I checked a few. So as I live in Dubai, like the first thing I wanted to see obviously was uh, what's up in Dubai. So we have, uh, for example, Rixos, the Palm Luxury Suite collection here. Okay, so I know it's like super expensive. But you see here, this is even an offer from a booking. Okay, this is one of the very rare cases where we actually beat them. And it says like early 2023 deal. So that's how you can actually see that this is an offer. So this is a total price of 14277 plus 3266 in tax. 
Okay, that is um, over 17,000, as it says here, actually, 17,538. But with Jifu, you only pay 7,343. And this includes the tax, okay? There was also a question here in the chat. So this one includes uh, the tax, okay? So um, there's another question from Svetlana. If I get genius discount on booking, does that count for the price guarantee? Yes, you always get a price guarantee. doesn't matter. If you show that it's somewhere else cheaper, you get a price guarantee. And I'll show you that in a second. Okay, let's go for, for somewhere else. Um, so let's go for, what do we have here? Uh, let me quickly check what I was checking here. Yeah, so this was Cairo because we have a lot of uh, Middle Eastern people. And I was actually looking for Cairo, okay? So we have the Steigenberger Hotel. That's how you pronounce it in German, okay? Steigenberger, Steigenberger. Uh, in uh, Hotel El uh, Tahir, uh, and this one is one thousand four hundred seven dollars, and uh, with Jifu the same one is one thousand and sixty six, and this is tax included. Okay, so just a few examples, so you can see that uh, there's really really uh, good stuff going on here. Okay, so what I also wanted to show you quickly is, let me go up here, is the price guarantee. Okay, we just talked about that. In case you find it somewhere else cheaper, okay, here's how it goes. You click on price guarantee, but the right order is you need to do the order first, okay? You need to do your reservation first. And as you see here, there's no reservation yet. But the only thing you do, so let's say I found this here, I found it cheaper, okay? I would just copy this link go into Jifu and say, okay, competitor website URL, and I just paste it here and I put in the competitor price, boom, submit, and then I get the different, like 110% of the difference refunded. Okay? So this is how it works. This is the price guarantee. But I wanted to show you a few other cool things you might not know about. So first of all, hotels, obviously, let me zoom in a little bit so you have... Um, a bit better view, one second. Let me make that a little bit bigger here, like this, okay. So, let's go to condos, okay? Condos is amazing. Condos is basically, it's a hidden gem, I would almost call it. So this is more for spontaneous travelers, okay? How does that work? So you, you choose wherever you wanna go, and I recently did actually Mexico, let's see if that is still free, uh, because we were in Cancun like two years ago. But then you have to decide to do that within the next 7, 14, 21, 28, or 35 days, okay? This is for spontaneous people. So if you click here, let's say uh, we do uh, within the next 35 days, and we click on search. Why does it take a little bit uh, for the system to look? Because the system is actually searching from more than 60 different databases. Okay, so we all always need to give it a little bit of time. And now let's have a look. So we have, for example, let me see. Yeah, I, I like this one a lot. The Reef 28, okay? This is all-inclusive, four, four and a half stars, directly in Playa del Carmen, which is like directly at uh, like, like the hotspot. And this is 340 euros, and that's it. All-inclusive. Okay, and you get 544 travel points additionally when you book that. So what's the downside here? The downside is that this is limited to weeks, okay? So you need to travel uh, during a specific week. Let's see, for example, here. This one is from the 1st to the 8th of April. That's when it's free, okay? 340 euros, book, done. So I think that's a pretty good... <laughs> a pretty good thing, right? So this is actually what you find here in uh, in condos. So what most people haven't seen, you also have uh, different things like, for example, wine clubs, golf courses. If you go to activities, you can uh, book different golf courses uh, around the world. Yeah. So um, and then also what is interesting is cruises because cruises has the biggest savings. If you like cruises, check out cruises. What's not in there yet is, for example, uh, the AIDA, which is a big German uh, cruise ship uh, platform or a mind shift. But most internationals are in there already. Okay. 
And then there's another gem, which is here. Book a concierge appointment. If you need help with anything, you can for free basically book an appointment with a concierge and they help you out uh, with your whatever you need. You can even jump on a live chat here, okay? You can even open a live chat and just ask them, hey, I want to go on a cruise from this day to this day. Can you show me what you have? And if you need help, let's say you want to go with your team on travel, look here, group travel request at the bottom. Let me uh, move that up a little bit. You can actually see it. So here at the bottom, you have group travel requests. Here's, by the way, the concierge appointment. You couldn't see that before. So group travel requests. So you click here, and then you actually have the possibility to book for your group. So what you want to do, a business travel, a celebration, a conference, sports team, wedding, other, and then just say, hey, how many rooms you need, what's the destination, and this is the customer service. And I think that's pretty insane, okay? So let me shrink that down again, that we have a proper view here on everything. One second. Can I make that a little bit smaller? I think this way you can see everything. Okay, so this is what I wanted to share with you quickly regarding the platform. But there's one more thing I need to say as well. So we had in the past, when I say in the past, I'm talking about the last two, three weeks since we were building the business, right? But we had uh, people saying, hey, I don't see the same offers as you see. For example, we had people looking uh, in, uh, what was the one group? We had people in Baghdad, for example, looking. And they said, hey, I cannot see the same offers. We had people in Egypt looking. We had people in Germany looking. They were like, hey, I find better offers sometimes on, on Booking and Expedia. How does that work? So here's the answer, and I'll also give you the solution. So what happens is the company for the last four years was basically operating in the United States and basically operating with a small team in Asia, right? So the platform they worked with mainly is based in the U.S. So where do Americans go? Americans go, if they go to Europe, which they like, right? They go to Paris, they go to Barcelona, they go to uh, Berlin, uh, they go maybe to Istanbul. So they go for the big cities. Where they not go is like the little hidden gems we know. As Germans, we love Mallorca, for example, which is an island, right? Or um, uh, Italians might uh, love Capri. Yeah? Americans are not so familiar with that. Therefore, these uh, little areas are not yet activated on the platforms, but they will be, Okay. So the company is working very, very hard in the background. They even put new people, uh, like new customer service people and new people working on the databases to fill the platform that we have the same access from everywhere in the world. Please don't forget, we're just starting out, okay? And we already have amazing things everywhere. And um, that's uh, one thing to, to consider and to mention, okay? So yeah, Rahma just says, uh, same for African countries. But... Listen, guys, this is not a big deal, okay? This is nothing what takes like six months to activate. It's a little bit of work to to uh, go through the databases, but they're already doing it, so no worries. We're going to have the same amazing discounts everywhere in the world. So one more thing I want to show you quickly is um, how to activate your vacation voucher, okay? And then we go into the back office. So um, let's go into the vacation voucher. To get to the vacation voucher, you need to go to the website gfu.com, the main website. So here, what you do is you click on vacation voucher, which is over here at the top. Okay. So as soon as you clicked here, then this window opens. And this window actually says, perfect, claim your voucher. It's, you scroll down. And what you need to do here is basically just put in your data. Okay. So fill that out blah, 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 put your uh, GFU number and everything in, uh, cl t uh, t uh, <laughs> click yes, that's what I wanted to say, uh, select yes, so and then you can select the location. I just did one for uh, Phuket and for Koh Samui, I think, I'm going to show you in a second, and uh, you select that one wherever you want to go, and when that one is done, you click submit. So how does it work by the order? So next thing, what is going to happen you will actually receive an email here. And this is what I received, which is basically, let me uh, zoom in a little bit here again. So, hi Fabian, here's the opportunity to take advantage uh, of this vacation to Phuket. 
Compliments of Gifu. Click here to activate your vacation. So I click activate. And I haven't seen that yet, by the way, myself. Okay, so I have four days and two hours to activate. Uh, and now how it works, I first have to pay. So here's a full video explanation, uh, explanation how it works. You have 18 months to use the vacation after activating it. Okay, and uh, here are a few of the hotels that uh, actually will be available. Important is they only show hotels in the region that have at least four stars on TripAdvisor. Okay, so now if I say activate now, it will ask me to pay the fees first. Yeah, so here I brought up, I fill everything out. So for my location, which is Phuket, it's $216. And then I will see all the hotels I can use. Okay, as I don't want to show now here all my credit card details, I'm going to record a different video for you guys later. Okay, so, and this is basically how the travel voucher works. So you pay first and then you have 18 months and you can select from the hotels. You can even do upgrades, like even location upgrades. When you decide, hey, I don't want to be in Phuket anymore. I want to go to Las Vegas. Then there might be an option that you actually upgrade to Las Vegas. Okay. So the voucher is up to four people. Because most hotels allow four people in one room. If it's specifically reduced, then it says for two people. Okay. But the voucher is for two people minimum. Two to four. Mostly four, but in any case, two. Okay. So then... Um, vacation vouchers will stay in your office, yeah, in your back office. And after 12 months, if you have the big package, you will get three new vacation vouchers. All right. So one more thing with the vacation vouchers, as of now, how it works, you have to activate them with three different email addresses. Yeah? So if you activate one with yours, second travel you do with your husband, maybe you want to give it away to someone, yeah? but you cannot use the same email address for the same voucher. Uh, within a uh, one year of period, okay? Just that you uh, know about that uh, as well. Annie is asking, why do I have to pay for the voucher itself? You don't, you just pay the taxes. Let me show you quickly. You just move that here. Click here to see the, f the list of the fees, okay? Here we go. If you click there, then you see exactly what the taxes are for the different regions, all right? So in here, it's you see exactly how much it is before, and this is the tax what you have to pay for the different regions. For example, we just had Phuket, right? Uh, so Phuket, there was $28.05 per night. I had seven nights. That's how it equaled out my 200 and, uh, what was it, like something dollars, okay? This is how it works. So you know everything up front. There's no, you don't pay for, just go yourself. If you cannot read it, I just see from uh, Celia. Just go yourself, gfu.com, open the list, done. Pretty simple.